died 14 years ago this month, but tonight, the late Archbishop of New York, Cardinal John O'Connor, is back in the news after a most surprising revelation. Technically speaking, this prince of the Catholic Church was Jewish. CBS 2's Tony Aiello reports. He had great love and admiration for his Jewish brothers, and I think he would have been pleased. Mother Agnes Donovan, a close associate of the late Cardinal John O'Connor, calls this news a wonderful surprise. Research into his family background shows O'Connor's mother, born Dorothy Gumpel, was Jewish until she converted to Catholicism in 1908. Basically, Jewish law says if your mother is Jewish, you're Jewish. Jewish law also says if you convert, once a Jew, you're always a Jew. So. Uh, I guess he was Jewish. The story was first told in the Archdiocese newspaper, Catholic New York. Cardinal O'Connor's sister told the paper their mother never talked about converting. They assumed she had been Lutheran before she became Catholic. Quote, there is indeed a great mystery here. I do not know what inspired my mother to become Catholic, yet I am certain her Jewish roots were mysteriously planted in my brother's heart. As Cardinal, O'Connor helped broker diplomatic ties between Israel and the Vatican and condemned anti-Semitism as a sin. New York Jewish leaders often called O'Connor a brother. He acted like a brother and he was a brother. We look back and we see how deeply connected he was to the Jewish people. We see now that that connection was even deeper than he ever knew. Many New Yorkers who remember the Cardinal welcome the news. I like it as an Upper West Sider who happens to be Jewish. <laughs> Why does it put a smile on your face? Just because it's so incongruous. I think it's fascinating. I think it's great. It really truly crosses over all the uh, barriers that we have in this life. A Catholic Cardinal with a Jewish mother who helped bring the two religions closer. Tony Aiello, CBS 2 News. And the discovery of the Cardinal's Jewish roots came as his sister researched family history and learned their mother's parents were buried in a Jewish cemetery in Connecticut.